Ready to fight? Ready. Go All right, here we are inside the home of the New York Knicks. It is Madison Square Garden, and I think a lot of people remember when Conor McGregor and Eddie Alvarez ushered in this building as far as the UFC is concerned back in 2016. I mean, that place was insane. Conor McGregor became the UFC double champion. From outside of the arena to build up to the fight to end the arena when Conor became the king. This was a great moment in the world's greatest arena. Look, the best fight in history have happened here. And on that night, Conor McGregor etched his name in stone. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. When he gets close, he throws, he lands. But that punch, no good. He loaded up there on that high kick. Punches in bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing the shots. Together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. Oh, got to be careful taking too many of those leg kicks. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, faints upstairs. It's rushed to the Is not a factor for this striker coming out swinging early as we expected everything being thrown with fight ending intentions. He throws everything so hard when he said to us when we talked to him earlier in the week he goes I'm not afraid of anything I don't care if I can take it down as long as I get to put some leather on the guy that I'm fighting for. Well we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense but he's doing a great job blocking shots. Oh, He opened up now. Nasty cut on the bridge of the nose. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Beautiful. Oh, what a connection right up the gut. And that will do it. Wow. With a massive highlight at the garden. So how about that as he pounds him out for the TKO, prioritized the finish tonight, absolutely gets it with style points. A huge, huge result here in this arena tonight. It's always fun to see an athlete tell you what they're going to do, and then they do it. This guy told us he was going to get a finish, and that's exactly what he did. Him and his team are going to have a fantastic time tonight celebrating. They should all be very proud. The official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 47 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO Moore! Well, the celebration is on over there in the corner, and nothing subdued about it. They put a lot of time into this training camp and into this performance, and certainly their athlete delivery. It was a result that they desired. They said, I don't care 